Welcome to Morgan Now's 2022 Homecoming Special. I'm Leah Davis. And I'm Giordana Campbell. Today, we're taking you inside of Homecoming 155. This year was the first unrestricted homecoming after two years of limited celebration. Morgan State popped out in full force. First up, Randy Smith takes us to the pep rally, the official kickoff to homecoming weekend. What's good, Morgan State? It's Morgan State's 155 homecoming. We have Greek orgs here. We have cheerleaders here. We have all of the, the classes representing their colors. Can you tell us what kind of colors they have? Man, let me tell you about it. It's Morgan State 155, you feel me? We got the freshman class, they got white. We got the sophomore class in orange. We got the junior class wearing blue. And we got the senior class wearing that black. We're right here with the marching man. We got performances from the New York Story. Performances from the Morgan Nets. We got the Greeks coming out. We got the, um, we got Groove Out Groove coming out. It's going to be a movie all day, I promise you. Now, Morgan State University, we just had several performances here. We had Alpha Kappa Alpha who just performed Kappa Alpha Psi, and we have upcoming next Omega Sci Fi and Group Phi Groove. Stay tuned, you don't want to miss it. What's up, y'all? You know, it's your man Randy right here on Homecoming 155. You know, I'm right here in the stands with it. Yo, please tell me, what's your name? Brianna. Hi, Brianna. How you like the homecoming so far? Good, it's fun. It's fun. Okay, that's lit, that's lit. What have you, what have your favorite um, performance so far? Um, probably core. Yeah. Okay, that's cool. That's different. That's different. That's different. Oh, right, cool. That's cool. Nice All right. All right, love. So, what's your name? Kendall. All right. So, what have you enjoyed so far about this homecoming pep rally? It's just lit. Like everything is lit. Everybody's just having a good time. Everybody just having a good time. What you doing? What you doing? Chilling. Ready to get. Ready to party. Okay. This is Morgan State's 155 pep rally. My name is Ashlyn Wilson. My name is Randy, and you know. This, hey, it's Bear TV. Thank you, Randy. Next up, we go behind the scenes of the Morgan State coronation. Kayla Cade has the story. I'm Kayla Cade reporting for Bear TV's Morgan Now, and I'm currently outside of the University Center's ballroom for the 155 Homecoming Coronation. The theme is The Wizard of Oz, or rather, The Wiz. You see my green? Yes, Emerald City. Family and friends entered the ballroom with excitement to support campus royalty. Student actors performed The Wiz, acting as if they were Mr. and Miss Morgan. They were joined by modeling teams ABC and FAM. The crowd watched all of the Misses and Misters of each organization as they came from behind the curtain, greeting the crowd with waves and smiles. I am here with Kayla. Randy. So what are you guys' positions inside the coronation for today? Um, I play young Kaisha. I play young Eddie. What did you guys have to do to prepare for these roles? Improv. It's not really a script, so we just go based off of each other and the people that we're working with. After the show, we spoke to some of the campus royalty. Here's what they had to say. I am here with... Darren Scott. And what org are you representing today? I am with the wonderful Smooth Brothers of the Pi Eta chapter of Phi Mu Alpha Symphonia Fraternity of America Incorporated, walking as Mr. Symphonia. So can we get an outfit check? Uh, those shoes are gorgeous. Thank you so much. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> and how did you prepare for this moment? For this moment, uh, coordination in general, um, 
you know, I was getting the fit together, getting the court together. I want to give a big shout out to the muses. Everybody's been looking forward to meeting them. Uh, Miss Symphonia, Miss Red, Miss Black, and Miss Gold. Getting them together, getting myself together, making sure we was all on the same page. Where did you get your dress from? Amazon. Ooh, how much? It was like less than $40, y'all. Amazon gonna see me. Mm -hmm. And your suit. Oh, and your shoes. Those are cute. Can we get a... Yes, yes, ma'am. Yes. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yes, sir. Um, the suit, not gonna lie, I wore this to prom, but hey, as you see, it still fits. And it costs about roughly like 200, 160 ish around that range. You know, you got pay for the shoes. She was like 40, you know what I'm saying? But slight work. I am here with DW, Diamond Thompson. And what org are you representing today? We represent Fashion App Morgan, the elite. And why did you guys decide to become Miss and Mr. Fashion App Morgan? I decided to become Mr. Fashion at Morgan because I want to help everybody. I want to help everybody grow. You know, I'm a real loving person. I'm a family person. And I just, if I can help somebody else, I'm going to help somebody else. So I just want to pass on what I've learned and what I'm still learning to everybody else. Well, I viewed running for Miss Fashion at Morgan as a way of stepping out of my normal comfort zone. I've been on the modeling scene and dancing scene since I was about 10 years old, so I just felt that it was time for me to step up and help others and teach them the things that I know and give them the knowledge that I already have. We love that. And can we get a model walk? For the one time, for the one time. Yes. Oh, she's stubborn face. Give it. What? Ooh. And they are truly the faces of fashion at Morgan. Do y'all see these stunning faces? Absolutely gorgeous. And I am here with Mr. and Miss Morgan. Finish the sentence. I love Morgan because... I love Morgan because Morgan gave me a chance when nobody else would because... Let me tell you a short story. So when I came to Morgan, I wasn't absolutely like accepted. I had to go through CASA. And that's something that I really liked because instead of just denying me because of my, you know, my SAT score, they gave me the chance to prove myself, to prove that I belong here, to prove that I deserve an education, like a higher education. So that's why I love Morgan. <laughs> uh, I love Morgan because Morgan loves me. You see, uh, I only applied to Morgan State University and they accepted me with my GPA of a 2.9 and my SAT scores, which was like a 900 or something. And you know, I just always felt like I was meant to be with Morgan I, even before I started coming to the school. So, go Bears. This year's 155 Homecoming Coronation has come to an end. This was a great way to kick off Homecoming. Stay tuned and thank you guys so much for joining me today. I'm Kayla Cade reporting for Bear TV Morgan Now. Congratulations to Caution Eddie, Mr. and Miss Morgan State University. Next, we have Ayana Francis taking us behind the scenes at the Homecoming concert. Cardi B called Tomorrow too. What was it like working with another female artist? It was real cool. Then Cardi, you know, she knew it together like this. So it was cool. That's cool. That's this your first homecoming performance? And what was your mindset going into it? Um, this is my first homecoming. Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, you know, it's normal. We're not doing a lot of performance. It's a normal, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? This last question. Carry an exclusive on any upcoming projects that you Working on right now. Yeah, I'm dropping 11 11 next month. Yeah, they're trying to be turned. Don't feel y'all gonna do that job when they drop. Hey, y'all pre-save it right now. Pre-save it. Let's go. <laughs>
This year, there were two special events for students. Serena Chapel went to the Morgan Marketplace and Samaj Fleming went to the Bare Nick Silent Party. business. I do rolling trays, ashtrays, canvases, and a whole bunch of custom art. If y'all want to come check me out, follow me on Instagram. Over quarantine, I just tried to turn it into something bigger. I had a whole bunch of free time, so I kind of just tested it out on canvases, and I liked how it turned out, so I just turned it into something bigger. Today, I'm with... It's uh, Vincent with Exclusive. And uh, Vincent, well, tell us a little bit about your business and why you're here today. Well, you know, just came out here to Morgan State really just to promote the Exclusive app. It's a dope app that's in the city, you know what I mean? We, we promote right here uh, in Baltimore, as well as in Atlanta, in Nashville. We got the hottest brands, hottest streetwear, hottest women boutiques, hottest men boutiques. We got Jordans, we got health and beauty. We got everything you need on the exclusive app. Download it today at the App Store. Exclusive is in the building. You, know what I'm you heard them. Download it today. Hey, I'm with Aaron Williams and Chase Williams. And can you tell us a little bit about your business and what inspires you to create the business? Yes. So this company is called MSU, IMU, Together We Are Better. Um, basically, this is a, a NIL type of situation for the student athlete. My son Chase here plays on the basketball team. Um, and so what we're doing is we would like to have the, stu um, the student athlete come join. It basically, when they, when they join, uh, and we'll have a page created for them and then when they send it off to their family and friends uh, as they sell they'll get 25% of the, uh, the total sales and at the checkout there is a tip option they'll get a hundred percent of the tips they get paid the first and the 15th of every month so we're excited we want to give back to um, to the student athletes for their likeness like their performance they should be able to get for pay for their performance. And so we're excited about it. We have shorts, sweatshirts, and um, t-shirts. What's up, y'all? My name is Samaj Clement, and I'm here with Bear TV Morgan now. We're here at the Bear Nick Early 2000s Silent Party, and y'all see the line. The people is here. They ready to turn up with the headphones. So when we get inside, we're going to interview, see how people homecoming been going and stuff like that. And I'll see y'all inside. What's up, y'all? I'm here with Tay, Amora, Evenly, and they're all juniors, so I'm gonna get their feedback on that um, event. How do y'all feel about the silent party? Like, do y'all think it was a good idea? Are y'all having fun? Like, yeah, it's cool. I'm having fun. I'm enjoying myself. So I never been to a silent party, so I was excited to come. Yeah, this is my first time at a silent party, and it's a 10 out of 10. Do y'all think they should have like more events like this? Yes. For sure. Just more events in general, like more yeah. than they got. Come on. <laughs> Okay, and um, how is y'all homecoming going so far? This is our first this event. This is the first event. Yeah. Really? Yeah. But it's a 10 out of 10. Yeah. yeah. All right, that's good. Um, I hope y'all enjoy the rest of y'all homecoming. And I thank y'all for letting me interview y'all. Y'all no can get worries. back to the party. Thank you. Bye. All right, thanks. Cool. All right, y'all, we here with DJ Lil. What up? And I want to know, like, how you feel about tonight's event? Um, it's different. It brought like great vibes. So I ain't gonna lie, like it's different. Like I saw Bowie State do it, 
And then I said, when Morgan State's gonna bring it here, it's gonna be a, like a ton of fun. Like, it's not something we've done ever before. So it's like, as you see, the turnout is crazy. The vibes are here. Um, me and Z turning up, DJ KD, Molly Mall, you feel me? We all lit. So I, I definitely encourage we do more events like this more on campus. So, you know, a lot of people not distracted and doing other stuff because this is very good for the campus, in my opinion. My name is Samaj Women. You're watching Bear TV, Morgan Now. And this is the Bear Nick early 2000s silent party. We had a blast. They still turning up. It's up. Thank you for watching. We'll leave you with the main attraction of the week, the day you guys all have been waiting for, game day. Thank you for watching and see you next year. What's going on Bear TV? I'm Zakia Jennings. And I'm Kaja Watkins. And we are here at Morgan State's homecoming game playing Norfolk State. It is our homecoming 155. So many people are out here celebrating and watching the game. So let's check it out to see what's going on. It's the most exciting time of the year on Morgan State's campus. All Morganites from every generation get to come together and celebrate a place they call home. Vendors promoting their businesses, alumni cheerleaders proving that they still got it, and so many more amazing memories being made. We just wrapped up halftime and now we're in the third quarter with three minutes and 43 seconds left. Morgan State has seven points versus Norfolk with 17. Let's see how it goes. The crowd is pumped as Morgan State scored many points to now take the lead. Nothing tops off a homecoming more than winning the football game as it is the most important game of the season. Unfortunately, in the last five seconds of the game, Norfolk scored a touchdown, taking the win. But that didn't put a damper on the Morgan Knights as they still had a very happy homecoming. This is Kaja Watkins reporting for Bear TV, Morgan Now. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.